Hey everyone, I'm Steven21967. We are in the infected, and today I am going to work on making my extractor safe. So I kind of put some placeholders where I was thinking about what I wanted to, how I wanted to set up making my oil and mineral extractor safe. So if a Vambi or a predator comes through here and hits them, uh, how exactly I would. Uh, Put the build the defense around them so they're actually safe so one of the things i need to do is i want this to be wide enough so that i can still get through in between like this rock and this fence i think we also want to wa watch how close to the fence we are i've seen vambies go up and over these rocks if we get too close it's possible the vambies will go over and straight into the area that I fenced off and then they're going to go crazy because they'll be fenced in and they'll start hitting everything and and then that'll destroy everything so it looks like we have enough room over here enough space to get through here if we need to so I think I think I'm happy with how all this is set up it looks pretty straight yeah I think yeah I think we're going to do it right here we're going to do it right here Okay, let's just get let's just get this started. We don't need any of those. We're gonna need a bunch, a bunch of logs, and fortunately for me, I have a bunch of logs way over here already cut down. Let's just grab everything, and this is gonna include. So, the way this is gonna be built is the sides and the back of the uh, fence that we're gonna put around the extractors is going to be the fence and then the front side of the uh, of the fence will be the gate so each extractor is going to have a gate in front of it that I can open up and easily access the uh, the extractor on the other side at least that's what I think is going to happen that's what I think is going to that's how I'm going to plan it if I kind of thought it out what I want to do I need uh, let's see I need some rope we can get that in just a moment. Let's see. Yeah, let's just go all the way through. Doesn't matter. I mean, the log the log cart goes through everything. The log cart's like, it carries all these logs, but it can just go right through pretty much anything. There's, the log cart doesn't have, log cart doesn't have anything that can cause it to uh, have problems with getting, getting through. You know, you can bring this upstairs through doors that are not wide enough for the log cart it's kind of odd but you know that's just the way that is so hopefully this won't take too long get a chance to clean up this mess over here I'll just grab that anyway yeah, each of the fences apparently needs six logs, and then they need rope. I have plenty of rope. Um, I know there's trees over there that have regrown, and I could certainly chop those down and save myself from running back and forth here, but I already have all these logs. I've been kind of wanting to get them out of there anyway, so why not just go over there, grab them, bring them over. It's a little extra time, but it's going to be not that much extra time. Alright, so that needs that needs one. That needs one. Do, do I not have a log in my hand? I, I guess I don't have a, a log in my hand even though it shows me <laughs> there's still a problem with that the developer thinks he fixed the issue with the uh, ghost log I will call it a ghost log but with the log that is not actually there all right there you go <laughs> watching it dance around all right that's fine that's fine you know it gives some stuff to do I guess Gives us stuff we can complain about. Yeah, I I'm hope I hope that the patch will be out for the greenhouse and everything pretty soon. I would definitely like 
to take advantage of the fact that I'm in winter to set up the greenhouse and then to try to plant a, a seed in a plant bed while it's winter and see if there's any problems with that because I have read um, some comments people saying that yeah that their greenhouse doesn't keep everything safe during uh, during winter it doesn't keep the plants safe from from dying all right so um, big question I guess you no know, I do plan on occasionally doing things like what I've got here with with these extractors over here so I think we're going I think the plan will be to include these extractors over over here so these these are my cobalt extractors I think we're going to include them in this protected area but when they're not over here the cobalt extractors will be way over over in the cobalt extracting section I mean we could change our mind maybe if we wanted to you know what it should do let's get let's get this done let's let's get these put together all right, let's get that started up. Let's get the back portion started and get that in place. All right, birds, this is not a bird meeting place. You guys got to go, you know, anywhere, anywhere but here. All right, I got that should be more enough. Let's get this out of my hands should have enough to get those started okay so we're gonna get we're gonna get these first the, the mineral extractor the the three mineral extractors that are usually over here in this oil extractor okay so that's set up good good yeah try to get it straight if I can but that could be hard at times trying to get these things straight all right and then one more all right so that's fine that's that's good where it is don't think we need to move that oops grabbing the wrong thing others wooden gates okay it's got one wooden gate um hmm why is that why is that showing me backwards okay I can't get up on that why is that showing backwards oh okay we'll just let's just mess around with it okay let's see okay feel kind of stupid I forget things, simple things like that sometimes. Okay, those are at the front. I want this to open outward. How, what do I need? I need 12 wood logs and 4 copper ingots. Oh my lord. 12 wood logs. And a copper ingot. So we'll try to get just one of them, at least one of them done. Try to get the uh, oil extractor at least set up. We're not going to put individual uh, fences in between each of the extractors. It'll all be inside of the fencing, the same fencing. But I might make, uh, I might just make one fence. One, one enclosure for the extractors are supposed to be over here. Okay, so we need some copper. Three, four. All right, buddy. Come here. Come here. Come on. Yeah. All right, that's not too bad. That needs some repairs. Yeah, I'll have to check that pretty soon. All right, one. I don't know. Okay, 12 logs. All right. 
That's fine. Yeah, I'm fine with leaving it right here. I don't want to put my 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 uh, extractor somewhere further away. I like them close to the base. All right. Let's just go knock these trees down. I just want to grab one. Alright, so we got one there. That should do that. Should be fine. You see, there's a lot of room behind those mineral extractors over there. So, we can still push that back there. And we should be okay. We should be able to fix it one wide and it'll be okay. Okay, we need copper ingots. I need to build a door back here. I got a door over here. I need a door on the opposite side, I think. Copper, copper. I think this is all my copper. One, two, three, four. I can grab more. One, two, three, four. I'm just counting this. One, two, three, four. All right, good. We got lots of. I think we need right now we need just four doors all right so all right and then you go in here access it oh, look at that 51 close it up that's safe all right now um off that's not on <laughs> i forgot to turn put it filled it up with oil and totally forgot to turn it on um I'm so worried that if I move this all right um, okay let's just do this I'm just gonna grab everything that matters okay that all matters so if all of a sudden there's nothing inside okay good good I just wanted to make sure that when I lifted up everything inside the the hopper inside this crate is uh, doesn't suddenly disappear when I lift it up and it looks like the oil is okay, so it didn't disappear. Put that in there. Guess I can, but you know what? I don't need that. All right, so you grab this, get this in place. Um, let's see. Let's put it back there. I think. Um, I know you say you could do like one door, but know what I'm going to do? I'm doing two doors, all right? I'm going to do... No, not two doors. I'm going to do... Each one of these is going to have its own door to get inside of it. Is that okay? Has that got the handles on the right side? And that one's off. Let's get this out of there. And that one is off. Okay, get that out of there. See, that looks really good. I can uh, can move it a little bit over here if I want. Let's just... Yeah, we're just fiddling around with it. Could do it right, right about there. Right about there. You open up the door. You have access to it. Does that look okay? Does that look okay? I want to be, I want to be, I want to be a little finicky, guys. I'm going to be a little finicky. I'm going to move that, okay, back a little bit. And, yeah, that's pretty centered. All right, let's get, you know what? You're probably as sick as I am running back and forth. Oops. Let's just do this. Let's just... We're going to cut down these trees. I should be able to get enough from what's remaining here. Uh. Yeah, I know. It's like, don't you want to grab all those logs you have on the ground over there? Well, now I'm, now I'm like anxious. It's like, it looks good. It looks good. It's looking like it's coming together. Now I just I just want to I just want to get the work done. At least I want to get the the extractors are usually at this site up and protected, and the other ones um, we can build those in a little bit. Okay, yeah, I can go right through there if I want to, because this cart will go through everything, even though it should. Okay, we got all the ingots in there. And I 
think that big tree over there is one of those trees that can't be cut down. Oh, that snow is so bright. Oh, my lord. There's something about the bright snow. I wonder if there's a setting that will allow me to turn that down a little bit. Okay, it's good. It's right there. Go in. Access it. Good. And then we're done. Close that up. And we're going to do one more. No, we're going to do a couple more. Okay. Looks good. I hear a bear. I think it's outside of the base, but I hear it anyway. Give me a sec here. One more thing. Let's just make sure. Yeah. That looks like that'll that'll be fine. That'll that'll close it off. That should close it off. So everything is still lining up all right. You can go grab some wood logs back. We'll cut down a couple of trees over here. It's so, it's so odd we can just do that. Yeah. We already got logs cut down. Let's go get them. Let's go get them. See, so, yeah, I'll finish off that first part of the enclosure for, for the oil extractor and the three mineral extractors for this site. And we will not worry about the the second the the three others that I brought over to help extract uh, aluminum here because I have I have uh, over a hundred cobalt well over a hundred I think I have like 120 plus cobalt ingots I'm not worried about whether or not I'll run out of cobalt for building Okay, good, 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 good. Open it up. Go inside. You know, I'm gonna... These are almost done. I'm just gonna leave that one off. And we'll go and try to get that one started up. Uh, we'll, we'll start that up at a, at a later time. Okay, so... Right. Let's get here. Alright, we can probably move that around a little bit. Yeah, we'll, we'll be able to move that around. Place both other wooden gate. Those, yeah, that's on this side. All right, and then you, I'm going to reposition you one more time. Try to get you center. That's centered. Looking good. And then I'm going to close this off. Right? Okay, give me a sec here. I'm going to get rid of this one. This one's kind of throwing me just a little bit. Oh, I did put some logs in there. <laughs> did I? Did I, these all have logs in them? No. Just that one. Just that one I changed my mind about. All right. So this first part, this is the way if, if I didn't want to bring anything over here. Let 
this would look like this. That is sealed. I could I yeah do you want to bring it over a little bit more we could push that over a little bit yeah we could okay let's go all right make sure I'm clicking on the right thing before I destroy it and actually destroy my uh extractor that would uh okay that's there and this this is uh I'm, I'm gonna move this real quick real quick and redo it one more time i know i'm being a little i'm being nitpicky but you know i want to be that way Doors up front. I don't know if I'm ever going to be able to get this straight. I'm going to have to make one more shot. One more shot. One more shot at moving that around. One more shot. My mouse wheel is like uber. Oh god. Uber annoying. But it still works perfectly fine, so there's no reason to replace it. What does this need? This needs six wood logs. Okay, that looks good. Right, we're good there. We need a little of that, a little of that. Fills up a little bit. We'll get some protein in just a second. Oh god, this is this is going to kill me the fact that I cannot get this straight. Maybe it wasn't going to be straight no matter what. One more shot. I'm going to try. Yeah, it's going to be the best we're going to get, right, guys? You're like, yes! Oh, God, yes, please. Watching you spend five minutes on one gate trying to get it positioned right. Yeah, that's enough. That's enough of that. Seems like we got maybe some weather rolling in. Might have a blizzard maybe coming through. Let's get this stuff over there. a snowstorm a uh, blizzard I finish this up in a blizzard and um, at least we'll get this much they'll get this much taken care of okay I gotta get some more copper ingots here and one more wood log one more, one more woodlock. 
freezing. We're cold. Yep, we'll be fine. We'll be okay. Be okay. Yeah, it's negative 32 degrees. But we'll be okay. We'll be okay. Okay, four. Need four iron or cobalt ingots. This is on, right? Yeah, that's on. There we go. It's nice and warm now. One, two, three, four. And... Just want to see if I can... Do I want to keep that with me? Do we want to keep the, the chips? I mean, really? All right. All right. Here we go. Last one. And we're going to move this over here. Put that down. Open it up. Everything there. Oh. We're out. That's uh, all used up. All the fuel there is used up. So. There we go with that. Okay, I left the power off on that one. Let's just put it over here for right now. So that's kind of the way that's going to look. Let's take a look up here. Yeah, yeah. So I don't know if I need to do this. I don't think I need to do this at any of my other sites just because... I don't spend a lot of time at the other extractor sites. I have to worry about, you know, being attacked and having them accidentally attack my my extractors. I think this is where I spend most of my time. This is where the biggest danger is going to be. And it says I'm cold. So that's fine. We're cold. And uh, let's get a little protein. A little bit of that. Oh, I feel like some dried fish. There we go. That's on. Power's good. Kind of late. Yeah, it took a little damage. But there we go. There we go. We did it. We did it. We're done with it. We now officially have all of our extractors from this site. The extractors are all now safe. And we're in a blizzard and I'm going to get cold. Okay, so I'm going to stop the video at this point. Um, I think I will build a second containment area for the extractors that I brought over from the cobalt site, extraction site, because sometimes I'm going to bring those over here to get more aluminum, because aluminum just seems to be something that I keep needing if I want to build more wind turbines, for example. And I already have a ton of cobalt. I have more... I have more cobalt than probably all the rest of my ore combined iron cobalt and uh, yeah and aluminum I, or iron and uh, <laughs> iron copper and aluminum i have more i have more cobalt than all those three combined so that'll be it for this video guys thanks for watching pretty soon i know we'll see uh, patch 6.0 go live and that's what I'm waiting for I'm waiting for it to go live and then we'll start playing around with uh, building the different things that are in there and we're overheating now okay so that's it for this video if you enjoyed it please give me a thumbs up subscribe hit the notification bell and you get alerts when I come out with new videos and yeah that's it for this one guys so see you later dudes